Oh, it's looking at me. Oh, it's looking at <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Fevernini here, and welcome to this game called Noctambulet. I probably said that all types are wrong, but I've been really wanting to play a scary game for a while. This is a game about why you sh basically shouldn't, like, why this girl can't leave her room at night. That's probably why. <laughs> like, her parents told her she needs to go to sleep early and stuff like that, and they also passed away, so... We're gonna go ahead and I guess we're gonna crack this mystery about what's what's exactly going on here. I don't know, this game really, like, intrigued me. Oh, my name is Rini. <laughs> Watch, I'd be saying that wrong the whole time. Rini. <laughs> I live happily with mommy and daddy. I love toys, all kinds of them. Okay. Oh, that's one of your toys? It's cute. It looks like Farah, like from Overwatch. On my birthday, mommy made a doll just for me. I hug it every night to sleep. I love the doll so much. And I love daddy and mommy so much. Until they died. Dun dun dun. Just kidding. I don't. I don't know. I think so actually. But something happened. Something really, really bad. The very next day, there was that what they call a funeral. <laughs> Goodness gracious! I, I should not be laughing about this. This is actually really bad. Ooh. And that's my grandmother, huh? The only person at the funeral was an old lady. She says she was my grandma and that mommy and daddy have passed away. Grandma said that I had to move in with her and we were on a car to her house right after the funeral. I only had the doll with me. I had lost everything else. Oh, that's kind of really sad. Mommy and daddy were gone. <laughs> Just hop in this car with this random old lady. Grandma's house was big. I was given new clothes, lots of toys and dolls in my own doll room. Everything I couldn't have before. Okay, the girl, the, the freaking grandma is loaded. And it has been six months since. Oh gosh. Aw, the little, the little play style is so cute. Don't you worry, little angel. Soon, I will find the other wing and you will be able to fly again. Oh. <laughs> and then my door magically opened. Ready? And <laughs> <laughs> my grandmother. It's 7 p.m. Time for bed. <laughs> my freaking grandmother. What the heck is that in the corner? Guys. <laughs> this is her doll room. And then they, they got that. Oh, my gosh. They got a doll that looked just like her. And then they got some freaking weird mannequin doll. I would not want that in my... What kind of freaking... Okay, whatever. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. Pack up your toys and hurry to your room. Yes, Grandma. <laughs> okay, that was the Grandma coming from the room. Okay. Every day, Grandma makes me go to bed early and locks the door shut. I don't understand that. I guess you're about to understand today. Okay, so do we... Oh, okay, cool. We just move around. A oh, I didn't see the other thing. I'm not gonna even lie. Let's just go over here. Gosh, I feel like there was definitely a button. Oh! I meant to do that. I don't know what I pressed. But okay, time is ticking past. He will always be loved. Okay, mommy. Is that mommy's ghost coming to, or you're just dreaming? Who's that? Whose feet is that? Oh, that's the mother. Oh, she's dreaming. Oh, poor little girl. Like, I know it's not really expressing a lot of, like, sadness right now. It's that dream again. Dot, 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 dot. I can't sleep. Now that I think about it, I didn't hear any locking sounds. Did Grandma not lock the door today? Grandma's been coughing a lot today. Is Grandma feeling unwell? Oh, my gosh. I thought that was, like, a usual thing. Like, that was normal for the grandmother to cough. Like... You know, but I mean, now that I think about it, that's probably not that usual. Rennie's, okay. I'll check if the door is really locked. Okay, you do that. Maybe I can go back to the doll room to play. Why would you want to do that? Oh, okay, here. Oh. Oh, okay. What is that? 
Oh, we got some color pencils. Rennie's color pencils. Her mom, mother used to draw with her back at home. Rennie would tell her mom what she wanted to draw and they would do it together. It is now one of her favorite activities. She loves to go outside of playing with dolls. Okay, cool. Mommy used to draw with me. So it's not important right now. Okay, so there's gonna be some type of hiding mechanic. That's that's great. We'd love to see it. Oh gosh. Oh, okay, so okay, press up if you want to go through a door. Is this a doll room? Oh. What? Okay. Okay, you can hide here too. This is disturbing. What is that? Okay, green bottle, green glass bottle. Thanks. Did I collect it? I guess I did. Oh no, I didn't. It's just there. Okay, I don't like this already. Where's the doll room? Grandma's sleep in the attic. I shouldn't disturb her. Okay, I can hide here. Can I run? She can't run. Her little legs cannot run faster than a walk. Someone's bedroom? Whose bedroom is- Okay. A uh, purple bottle. There's just a bunch of random bottles. Okay, so let's just take this time to explore. I guess this is just gonna be- Okay, so we're gonna be hiding from something. Clearly the thing from the title screen. Um, hallway. Okay. Um, is this the- Ooh. What could grandma be doing this late at night? You just said you didn't want to disturb her. Are you sure she's in there? Ooh. What is that on the floor? Did grandma drop that? Oh gosh. Oh, grandma's torn note. An offering for the three dolls? There's three of them? Two drops of blue, one drop of green, one drop of red, two drops of yellow. Then give the big shelf in the living room a knock. Okay. So I gotta try to remember that. I got the worst memory ever. But let's, I guess let's venture. Oh, I'm curious about what's that noise from behind. Why? <laughs> okay, so let's go. Oh, she's already up. She's already up. See, I was already suspicious. I guess we're not gonna question that. We're just gonna come over here. It's not safe now, you think? Oh gosh, okay. A hot. Becky? <laughs> Your name's Becky of all names? Nothing wrong with it. Oh! Eee! Hello? Oh, she's still coming! She's still coming! We gotta go. Come on. Hurry, 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 hurry. I think there's one down the shore. Come on, hurry, hurry. Hurry up, hurry up. There's one down here. There's one down here, right? Right? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. trap myself did I just trap myself <laughs> she really just stopped did her tricks can she see me oh she can she just whip she really said I whip my hair out of my face okay she's gone grandma sleeps in the attic I sh this seems like an emergency don't you think oh my gosh which room did she go to I don't, oh gosh. Okay, so first things first. My heart, my heart, this is actually, I was actually kind of making fun low key, but my heart, oh my gosh, okay. Two drops of blue, so I need blue first. Are you blue? You're green, okay. Actually, don't- oh! She's not gonna follow me, right? Like, she didn't really see me see- Oh. Man, why you have to come in the same room as me? Why are you freaking alive? Why did you do that? Dining room. I didn't explore here yet. Oh gosh, this place is huge! Oh! Red? Okay, I need blue. I need blue. Ooh, why is it so sparkling clean? 
Who's in there? There's someone in there. I'm not going over there. I'm not. Oh, she's here. Oh, please. No, no. She didn't see me? I'm already startled. Oh, what's this? yellow? Yellow, oh my gosh, I need a blue bottle. Oh, we finally found. Okay, so what do we do with it? How can I take it? I need it. How do I take it? Oh. Oh! Oh, okay, 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 okay. Okay, I mean, if I wasn't so stupid, I probably would have seen that already. Um, but let's go. Okay, so we got, we got, we got to do this. This is actually so nerve-wracking. Hope that she's not behind. Well, we're gonna have to wait till she leaves. But we also, we need to go get one green, one red, which is upstairs. I don't think it has to be, does it have to be in order? I'm just gonna get this now. This is why you don't leave your room. Imagine if she didn't go back to the doll room. She would have been good. She wouldn't have to be doing all this walking around ritual stuff. Watch her like be outside the door. Oh, oh! Huh. There's nothing in here. Came in here for no reason. Green? I don't like these freaking mirror holding dolls. Oh, get in! Oh my god! <laughs> Good thing, okay. Imagine if she walked right into me. Oh my gosh! Red? And then knock this one, right? Oh, what do we have to do? Was it wrong? I had to do the whole thing over again. Where did I go wrong? Was I supposed to do it in order? Okay, take my stuff. What? One drop of red, one drop of blue, or two drops of, oh my gosh, I don't know. What the heck, okay. Wait, wait. Is that red? I think. <laughs> If I'm using my small little brain correctly, I think that the stuff in the bottles is different colors than the actual bottles. So I'll make this fast for you guys. I ended up skipping out on reading two very crucial books in the very beginning of the gameplay. I ended up finding them later on, but I'll just insert them right here real quick so you guys can see what the puzzle was. What, over here? <laughs> Mommy used to read these to me before bedtime. Was I supposed to <laughs> wait, okay, wait, wait, maybe this is just a cutscene. Because I, I saw that sparkling the whole time. Oh, Book of the Colored Spirits. Once upon a time, there lived a sorcerer. He practiced a dark and uncommon magic, and all the people in the village avoided him. He was lonely and sad and moved to live alone by the hillside. The sorcerer used his powers to create five co colored spirits, the blue, the yellow, the red. If, if they tell me, if they tell me this whole time there was sparkling i just thought oh the grandma's really good at cleaning like it must be really clean i'm stupid they filled this dull and lonely life with colors and he was more joyful again but there was a group of royalty in the um country they were no smarter than anyone but held their nose high and snobbish snobbish they feared the power of dark magic and they took away their position. And so they sent many guards to patrol the village. Anybody caught with the use of dark magic were to lock up immediately. Upon hearing the news, the sorcerer was shocked. But most of all, he was worried for the colored spirits he has grown close with. In particular... <gasps> Guys. In a panic state, he created five colored bottles and hurriedly placed them into different bottles. The blue spirit into the red bottle! The yellow spirit is into... <laughs> With a quick change of clothes, the sorcerer grabbed the five bottles with him. He abandoned his house, setting off on a new journey disguised as a wine merchant. Oh, gosh. As you can see from the first book, it tells you which color drops are in which colored bottles so that it's not as confusing as I made it out to be because I ended up just going to every bottle and seeing what color came out of it. You take that concoction, you take it over to the doll offering table and there's another puzzle, which is where the next book comes in handy. For the next book, it describes which way every girl is looking. Book of three. Oh, please don't tell me this is gonna be about the dolls. 
Three curious girls, Lala, Lulu, and Lily, decided to leave their home to go up a mysterious pink mountain. The path up the mountain was fun. The three good friends side by side chattered merely through the twisted and turn of the road. Right before sunset, a thick fog enveloped the pathway, the trees, and the forest, and they could hardly see anything. As they couldn't see less and less, the three girls got more and more terrified. Let's hold hands, piped up Lulu, who was right in the middle. Reaching out her left arm, Lulu pulled Lily close to her. Feeling more sure, Lulu then reached out her right arm to pull Lala, but she couldn't find Lala's hand no matter how much she felt about the fog. Lulu spun to look to her right and her jaw dropped. A pale woman with long hair, black eyes, and an abnormally wide smile stared right at her. Lily, on the other hand, was looking straight ahead of her at the terrifying sight of her friend Lala hanging from the tree together with her many others. The bad three girls who decided to leave their homes to explore the mysterious mountain got punished dearly. Wow. You take that information, you make sure that the dolls are looking in that direction, and then you go over to the shelves and knock on it three times. Me, being my weird Nina self, ended up just going back and forth and doing trial and error. Just, <laughs> just had, I just went back and forth and was just like hoping for the best. But luckily I was able to get it on my sixth try of literally luck instead of looking through the book and finding the book. But anyways, that's it. And the rest of the gameplay, I'm more or less smart. So enjoy. Please. <gasps> yes! I did that by chance! Like, guys, I did that freaking six times! Why is there secret patches in this house? Oh gosh, okay. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Saved. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's more! I really thought that this was it. Basement map. Oh, an old piece of. Pa oh my gosh, why can't I just go to my grandma? Oh gosh, I don't like this. Oh, hand mirror, a pretty looking hand mirror that was broken by Rene. Her mom, her grandma took it away afterwards. I don't like mirrors, okay? Okay? Oh, it's looking at me. Oh, it's looking at me. What am I supposed to do? Huh? What? Oh my gosh. I feel like... What? I don't... Oh, this is so... Oh, get in there! Oh my gosh. I don't like this. Oh gosh, can I do it now? I can't. Okay, there has to be some type of, um... Pattern? You know, guys? Uh, that I don't know. Oh, this is so disgusting. Oh. I, uh, an old piece of... Okay, so... Oh, okay, wait, wait. So, I think that's... I'm going deeper into the basement, aren't I? Um, I'm gonna take a picture of that. <laughs> I need all... I need freaking all the brain cell and all the technology I can to be able to fix this. Let's just go and hurry up. I actually don't know which floor I'm on, so I'm just gonna go ahead and restart real quick. Go back to the beginning. Oh, gosh. Oh. Oh. So this is the first floor, guys. Second floor... Huh. Oh. Go through the second one. Wait, but there's... This is the thir fourth room? I need to get to this... Whoa, this is not the fourth room. Oh, gosh. Oh, please, no! Oh, 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 oh my God. I'm not focused on you right now. Leave me alone! Okay, so this went back to the fourth room, I think. And I, okay. And that takes you to the, okay, this takes you to the second room. I need to get, I need to, okay. 
So what I need to do, I need to open... Oh, gosh. I don't like this. I need to open... Wait, wasn't I supposed to open this one? Oh my gosh, what? <laughs> okay. I didn't, I didn't even need to look that clearly into it. Gosh, please stop doing this to me. It's giving me freaking all the puzzles in the world. Okay, so I don't know what this is about. Can you just dun, dun, dun. Wow! Gosh, I'm stupid. I'm so freaking stupid. Okay. Um, okay, so let's let's continue. Wait, before we victory screech. Dun, dun, dun. Wow, I'm so stupid, guys. I just had to follow. Follow what is written. As if I'm reading it. Oh my gosh, guys. Nina's brain does not work. Okay. And then just down, dun, dun. I'm stupid. I am stupid. The Book of Awakening. Thank you, thank you. At least I got something from that freaking, I'm stupid, why? This game is really making me realize how stupid I am. Chapter, chapter two? Did I miss chapter one? <laughs> oh my gosh, okay. The possessed often residing in objects that belong to the family will be cursed to only walk at night, guarding the residence of its own family. They're referred to as not, noctambulant spirits. Wait, are, so, guarding the residents of its own family. So, is it not supposed to be guarding me? What? If an outsider is seen in possession of anything that belongs to the family or have invaded into the premises, it will do whatever it means to remove- Oh! Oh! Wait, okay, so maybe the family is only just extended to the, the grandma, maybe? A few cases studies have been collected in relation to noctambulant um, spirits. A huge chunk of this section are, are descriptions of the case studies. Okay. This book, why is it here? I, I don't know. I wish I knew. Question mark? There's something else in the box. Paper charm. A diamond-shaped charm. It is filled with mysterious and unreasonable words scribbled in a specific pattern. This charm and the book, I've seen them before. The book was in mommy's study room and the charm was illustrated in the book too. Oh. Oh, there's definitely some lore that I accidentally skipped out on. I didn't want to remember that again. From what is written in the book, Be Becky, <laughs> I forgot that's her name. Becky's possessed by something to protect its family and that they go after outsiders. Who are not part of the family. Dot dot dot. This is the only second part. Where's the first part? Okay, I thought I missed something. Perhaps Grandma knows about it. After all, it's all hidden here in this secret basement. Maybe I can find more answers in Grandma's room. Oh gosh, I have to go all the way back up. Oh! Fudge. Stop. Oh gosh, I have to just make my way back? I don't even know how I got here. I don't even know how I got here. Don't look at me. Don't look at me. I don't even know where I am. Oh, I made it out. Hey. <laughs> I'm so smart. I forgot Becky's behind this corner, isn't she? I gotta make it back to the freaking grandma's room without Becky seeing me. I forgot that her name was Becky, honestly. Becky with the good. Becky with the good hair. Literally. Beyonce's song was about Becky, this Becky in particular. Becky, where you at? Where's Becky with the good hair? The good, good guys. Oh my gosh, this Becky really sat here and has the good hair. Oh, I thought that was something on the floor. What the heck is the grandma brewing up in there? Grandmother? Oh, a strong smell of ointment. It's a smell, it's a smell grandma always has on her. I have to be quiet as to not wake her. I thought I'm supposed to, I thought I'm just, oh, why am I not trying to wake her? Okay, chapter one, let's go. So after bringing one back in a different form, the user gets cursed to become the, wait, did I not, did I not read that correctly? Um, the user gets cursed to become a 
dambulent spirit after they die. Wait, I don't think I read that. Can I go? Oh, I have to actually physically. Okay, creation of a voodoo doll, otherwise known as the act of voodoo, is curse one performance to disrupt the natural flow of life. A ritual sought after by many. Voodoo is believed to have the power to bring one back from the dead. Voodoo requires a body for the spirit to return to a human medium to act as a pathway for the dead spirit to return back to the human realm. The human medium is to also create an object of personal attachment to direct the spirit's memory onto it. From a few case studies, it is also noted that ones brought back to life are never truly the same again. The act of voodoo- So wait, was Becky actually a person in real life? Is that what they're trying to get at? The act of voodoo is considered to be sacred grillless even in the act the world of dark arts the medium acting as a pathway for the dead to pass through the realm gives up their own pathway out of the human realm after death as a result the medium will be trapped forever residing in an earthly object bound to serve the family belong to all oh, that sucks that freaking sucks i'm sorry becky becky with the good hair oh gosh Hey, Grandma. Oh, what's this? Grandma's diary. Hey, she got hiding in here. February 4th, 2004. Carrie is still extremely distraught from the incident. It has been a whole year and even I cannot say I am not still very much affected by the loss of my very own granddaughter. Wait. Either she's talking about somebody else or she's a doll. Wait, okay. Um, Ned Nedrick looks very stressed whenever I go over, so I'm trying to give them space. Oh my gosh. Carrie has been writing once in a while to, to me, but this particular letter today was strange. She seemed hopeful and happy. I hope this will finally be heading in the right direction. I hope my sweet daughter will finally be back to how she was before. There has been no letter ever since. I'm still writing to them, but they have not gotten back to me. Maybe after sending that letter, they went on a trip. It's all for the better. Everything happened way too fast. The news of the passing of my daughter and my son-in-law arrived just before dawn. That was only... That was not the only thing that I was informed of. I was told to fetch their child, my granddaughter, as I am the only next of kin left. How? I'm still unable to come to terms with what is happening. So either they lost another child, I don't However, I must attend the funeral. I must find out what has been going on. I have fetched my granddaughter. It was my little Rini indeed. But at the same time, it did not seem to be her. She did not recognize me and I can only play along until I find out everything about this. My dear Carrie, what on earth happened? I cannot believe my daughter is just gone just like that. Last night, something very, very unusual happened. I had gifted Rini a lot of dolls, seeing how much she liked them. But when I went out for a glass of water, one of the bigger dolls was walking around. However, it did not do anything to me. Regardless, this is too strange. I have to keep Rini to her bedroom at night until I find out. So wait. Wait. The police arrived today. They are here to return to me the remaining properties they have taken from Carrie and Nedrick's household for investigation one of them was an old red book with parts of it torn out after reading it tonight i found out that the doll was carrie my beloved daughter she's still here oh my gosh okay so becky's carrie um i have also found out why my granddaughter is alive now carrie did something unforgivable oh how much pain she must be going through to resort to this i still have to keep rennie in her room until i find the rem remaining sections of the book i will have to look through the book again so it's true that becky is mommy freaking plot twist oh my gosh and rini died and the mom wanted to get rini back so she did some voodoo stuff and oh my gosh okay stuff is adding up and grandma knew all along is that why she kept becky around but why does she still have me here even though she knows that I'm not her real granddaughter. Even though I'm an outsider. <coughs> huh? Oh, she's coming in, isn't she? I'm not supposed to be out of my room this late. 
I need to get back to my room before grandma wakes up. What is- what is that? I can't pick it up. Oh gosh. Okay, that explains so much though. But didn't she come in the room? Should I be concerned? Isn't she downstairs waiting for me? Oh, she's not. Okay. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. Ooh. I think I might have to start running back. Oh my gosh. Is it that easy? Oh, okay. Hide! Something's coming. I need to hide. Go, 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 go. Oh. I don't think I was supposed to hide there. Wait, did I actually hide under the bed or did I just go to sleep? Is that old my grandmother? Oh, grandma, what? Ah, oh, she was laying in bed and is she really gonna hurt? <laughs> like, what the heck, grandma? Rainy, what are you doing under the bed? <laughs> I, I, you <laughs> haven't left your room, have you? N no, I was here all the while. I, I was just feeling afraid. There's nothing to be afraid of, my sweet little girl. Is that really true, Grandma? Of course, dearie. You shouldn't have anything to worry about other than Becky with the good hair walking around. <coughs> did you really not leave your room, Rainy? I... I did not. Alright then. <laughs> Grandma's feeling a little under the weather, so I must be muddled headed. I'll be headed back to bed. You should go to sleep, too. Wait, Grandma. What is it, Rainy? Do you think I am loved? Dot, dot, dot. Of course, my sweet little girl. Why are you asking such silly little questions? All right. Good night, Grandmother. Good night. Mommy chased me be because I was an outsider. And Grandma came here so quickly she must not have been chased. She must have not been chased, because they are family, and I'm not. Grandma lied. She doesn't see me as her family, but I'm sure she loves me. She's hiding something. I'm sure she- Whoa, okay, wait, is this gonna, like, mess up? Oh, gosh, okay. I wish I could save this, but I'm sure she loves me. I'm sure either way, because she's trying to figure stuff out. I'm sure she still loves me. Grandma knew about me all this time, but still allowed me to be here. She locked me up in the room every night to keep me safe. How could I have doubted her? Yeah, I don't think, I don't think she doesn't, like, I think she does care for you. Mommy told me, too, that I'm also family and also loved. And what I need to do now is to believe in them and not make Grandma troubled anymore. Dot, dot, dot. That torn section of the book that Grandma didn't have, I know where it is. I knew all along. I need to get to my playroom. This is not over yet. Oh gosh. Becky. Be Becky. Watch her be waiting for me in here. What over here? <laughs> Mommy used to read these to me before bedtime. Was I supposed to <laughs> Wait, okay, wait, wait. Wow, okay. Okay, so it was in my little doll the whole time. Rini doll, a custom made doll that looks like Rini. Oh, it's not. Is it in here? This doll was gifted from Rini's mother. Both wings have fallen off and one of them was lost way back before her parents were alive. Chapter three. Ooh. To release the trapped not tombulant. <laughs> I, it just doesn't get any easier to say. Spirit, simply soak the charm in unclean water thoroughly. Water turns unclear when touched by other spirits. When the incarnation on the charms are smudged and corrupted, the charm will then be needed to be placed anywhere on the object of which the soul is trapped and the ritual is complete. It is note that the water used to soak the charm will start to corrupt. It starts the moment it comes into contact with the charm and is extremely dangerous for humans. Saturate the water with salt and dispose of it after ritual is done. Unclear water. Where can I find water? In the bathroom? In 
here maybe? I see sparkle sparkle. Someone's taking a shower. Oh gosh. Oh. Okay, let's go. I forgot that was a thing, honestly. Um, the once lifeless paper charm now after being soaked in the bathtub gives off an ominous energy not to give, but to take away. Now I just need to get back to the doll room to- Are you serious? Wait, wait, she came in when I was- Go, 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 go! You don't see me? You don't see me! I'm about to say, I was actually gonna get so upset. She gonna do the- ha! Gotcha! Go ahead, do it! Oh, I could have escaped right there. I probably could have just left as soon as that happened. Wow, okay, now I'm stuck. Now I have to wait for her to go. Oh, we good. We good. Okay, we good. Let's go. Oh, she was just waiting in there. Oh, is, is it morning time? Oh, look at her. Look at her. She looks like she's about to do something. Like, she looks like she's about to do something bad. Okay. Don't I have to put salt on it or something? Okay. Just walk off like nothing happened. I'm sorry, mommy. I have done it. Oh, God. I mean, at least, like, what you released her soul, right? On that day, I found out about something I should never have. Boy. Mother's study room filled with notes and studies on how to get back her daughter. The book had all the information, ones that would take everything from me. Oh gosh. And then that was the doll she made for you. I was so scared that would happen. I had to do what had to be done. And so I hid it, something precious. I brought it everywhere with me. Even back at the funeral, I was hurt and scared. I had to keep the doll with me just in case. Rini, let's go home. Those kind words of grandma, they warmed me up. It was foolish of me to be held up by silly thoughts. Mommy and now grandma, they care about me and I have to do this for them. So she knew this whole time! I always hated mirrors because they reminded me of what I am not. But now, I'm not afraid anymore. So she knew the whole- It's a new morning and a new beginning. This is the real beginning. So she knew the whole time. Oh my gosh. Justice Yi! That was amazing! I freaking love it! Even though I was being completely, completely, completely stupid. Guys, I know. I know, guys. I know in the comments you guys are gonna be like, You stupid! You didn't check this stuff! You didn't check everything! That's what you gotta do in these type of games! But honestly, in my head, I was just scared. And I just did not want to... I really did not want to get caught. So most of the time I was running, I did not want to stop for nothing. That's my only excuse, honestly. But, oh my gosh, that was such a good game. I really liked it. It was like, ah. Uh, like, I don't expect this to really do that well, I guess you can say. But I really enjoyed this. And I really wanted to play, like, a scary game. And I feel like this really delivered. And it had such a cool story behind it, too. Let me know, guys, if you want me to find the other endings for this like if you actually want me to play through and get the other endings if a lot of you guys want me to do it then i'll actually go back and do it because I, I i know what to do now i'm not gonna be stupid about it but anyways thank you guys so much for watching let me know what you guys thought about this game down below in the comments i always love hearing from you guys if you guys like this type of stuff i would do more of it i like this type i like these type of games this little like scary but like puzzle solving because clearly i need to work out my brain a little bit more I can't just be playing Friday Night Funkin' because that doesn't do anything for the brain. But anyways, if you like this video, don't forget to leave a like down below. And if you want to see more from me, feel free to check out my channel and tip the subscribe button. And I'll see you in my next video.
Nina out. <laughs>